This video and hundreds more like it, available on freephotoshopvideotutorials.com. In this video, we're going to show you how to enhance the color of a photo by quickly creating some extra layers with uh, blending modes. Are you going to be using primarily two uh, layers with the blending modes as needed? And we're going to show you how to do this uh, right now. So here we have a photo, which is uh, it's not bad. I mean, the uh, the color and so forth is actually quite good, but uh, it could be improved. You could pop out a bit more of the color. So to do that. And, and to see if it is necessary, we can always compare before and the after. We'll just open up our Layers palette. And now we're just going to duplicate our layer. And the shortcut to do that is Control and J. So let's go ahead and do that. Now that we have an extra layer here, we're going to set the blending mode here to uh, Soft Light. And as you can see, the Soft Light punches up the color. It adds more contrast to a photo. So here's the before and here's the after. But um, it does tend to make the shadows a bit too dark, I find. So uh, the one way to combat this is to create another layer with uh, with a blend mode. So let's just go ahead and do another Control and J. And now we're going to change the blend mode of this to Lighten. And now uh, if we uh, add and remove Lighten, you can see that whereas the darks over here were really dark, Lighten brings that back. So we can compare the before and the after. And as you can see, it has punched up the lighter areas. Uh, while maintaining the um, the shadow value of the original photo, right? So this is the new one, and this is the before. So it's just a little bit punched up. So um, what you can do now is tweak it a little bit. So for example, in the lighten here, um, it is it is um, taking back the shadows to basically to what the original photo was. Now I like that to be a little bit more punched up. So what we can do is just reduce the lighten value. Uh, you can do that by just a shortcut on your keypad, you know, press 9 for 90% and 8 for 80, 7 for 70 and so on. And now you can compare the before with the uh, alt and, and clicking on the eyeball here and the after. So as you can see, we've made the shadows here darker and I'm liking the darkness values of these shadows here, so that's good. And then the other thing to pay attention to is obviously the uh, the light values here, the lighter area. So here's the before. And here's the after, and I find that it's getting a little bit too, too washed out this area here, right? So what we can do now is just again reduce the value of that soft light to something like seventy percent again. Let's have a look and see what that does. Okay, that's doing a pretty good job. So we have a soft light at seventy percent and a lighten at sixty percent. Usually they'll be around the same region. So between you know, if one is 60%, the other one would be plus or minus 10 and so forth. So just to give you a ballpark value, they'll be around the same value, depending on the photo. And uh, as you can see, the before and the after. And all it does is just punches up the photo slightly, making it a little bit nicer without losing any of the detail in the highlights and the shadows. If you enjoyed this video, show your support by subscribing, rating, and adding it to favorites. Leave comments on our website and we'll create even more videos that interest you.